How you doing guys? I'm back with another video. Today I'm in Holiday Park in Fort Lauderdale, Florida. And I'm going to do a little metal detecting with you guys. See you guys in a bit. Alright guys, I'm back. I'm getting ready to start metal detecting. I wanted to show you what we're going to be using today. Uh, some good all-purpose equipment. Alright. We're going to use today my Technetics Delta 4000. It's a good, lightweight, all-purpose metal detector that you can, you can really swing it all day. You can swing it all day long. It gives off good signals. It's a good piece of equipment as far as I'm concerned. I've got my gator shovel, rubber grip. You should always have some gloves. I have my Garrett pinpointer. It comes with its own little sleeve. And I just use a generic uh, bag to carry my findings in. Um, and that's what I'm going to be using today. Gonna be, over here we have some soccer fields. It's a really nice park, holiday park. But I'm going to be, I don't want to dig up the soccer fields obviously, but I'm going to be hunting this area over here along the tree line. And I'll get back with you guys when I see something. There's a guy sleeping over here. Look at that guy. Get out of here, guy. Here we go, guys. I've been hunting for about five minutes, and I got my first solid signal. Here it is. Let's see what it is. I'm not sure what that looks like to you guys, but we're going to see how this works. Watch the watch. I found it stuck in the dirt here. Let's see what it is. It's a nickel. Nice nickel. See you guys in a bit. Just a heads up, guys, on the Technetics Delta. Uh, it has a couple different modes and a couple different things you can do in the menu. Uh, like a lot of different metal detectors, it has discriminate mode and all metals mode, which you can switch just by hitting this mode button. Okay, so in all metals mode, you see that it finds iron foil says there five cents aluminum zinc dime quarter fifty cent piece uh, when you're searching in discriminant mode uh, you have the option to notch I don't know if you see it highlighted there right now uh, you can change the sensitivity up and down you can set the discrimination level from low to high or you can notch particular items out. I have notched out iron, foil, and aluminum because this place that I'm searching is very dirty. Uh, so it benefits me to have those things shut off, I think. Anyways, I'll get back with you when I find something else. Okay, so we've got another solid nickel sign, five cent piece. It's got me on a 57 repeating signal. 58 repeating signal. Let's pinpoint it. it. Says it's one inch down. Let's see. One inch down. All right, I've dug my hole. I'm going to get out my Garrett pointer, turn it on. Those clicks indicate that it's on, plus it has that little light there. I'm going to check our hole. Nothing in the hole. Here 
here it is. Let's see. Let's see here. Oh, there it is. Got another, got another nickel. All right, guys. See the see you on the next one. All right, guys. I'm back again. Got another signal here. Again, we're reading a. It's reading a solid five cent piece. Fifty six, fifty seven, fifty eight, fifty nine. It's kind of. A little jumpy. Let's pinpoint it here. Right here. Two inches deep. Let's see what it looks like. All right, well, I've dug my hole here. I got my Garrett pointer out. Nothing, nothing. Ah, still in the hole. Oh, look at that. It's an old can. Piece of can. Such a piece of can. By the way, guys, when you're digging up these, uh, what are these called? Plugs. When you're digging up these plugs, you make sure that you put the grass back nice and neat. That way you don't get kicked out or get in trouble. People harassing you about digging the holes. Do your best. Sometimes it gets a little difficult. But do your best. Use your shovel. Use your tools. I forgot to tell you guys, a white rag works wonders. Uh, helps you clean off your stuff afterwards. Just uh, be courteous to other people. I'll get with you on the next one. All right, I've got another signal here. Let's see. Where'd she go? There she is. It's another solid nickel symbol. Signal, 57, 58, repeating. Let's check it out and see what it really is. I hope it's not another piece of aluminum. I've got that notched out, but that didn't help on the last find. Let's see what we got here. Actually, I wanted to pinpoint that real quick. Alright, it says it's one inch down. Let's see what we got. I wanted to show you guys the Garrett pointer one more time. It's able to pick up this signal without even digging a hole. So we know that it's right there. That's where we're going to dig. All right, let's see what this is. Oh, I just turned it off. Nothing. Oh, there it is, right there. We've got us another nickel. Anyways, this was a short trip. I'm going to pack my stuff up. I came metal detecting because I had a, about an hour or so. I'm going to head back to the car over there. I've got a rental car. I had to drop my car off in the shop to get serviced. Uh, I'm going to go pick it up now. I'll show you the guys, the, uh, the car that I rented or the car that they lent me. And I will uh, then show you my car later. All right, guys. I'm going to close up this hole. I'll see you guys in a bit. You know, I'm walking back to my bag here got this bag here that I keep all my stuff in. I dismantle my metal detector every time and put it away. Something I wanted to bring up to you guys, anytime you guys are metal detecting, this is that piece of can that I found. I put it by my bag so that I wouldn't forget it. Anything that you guys dig up that is garbage or not important to you, uh, you made the effort to dig it up. Go ahead and throw it away. Yeah, go ahead and, you know, throw this stuff away because it, it doesn't help the environment. You've already made the hole. This could hurt some kid. You know, it's a beautiful park. 
this sharp little piece of aluminum could do some damage. So just be, again, be courteous to people. You'll never have a problem. You'll never have a problem with people wanting you to go away or uh, they say that you're bothering them. You're, you're making nice, um, you're pulling nice plugs, you're putting your stuff back, you're taking away the garbage, you're being courteous, you're not throwing the garbage on the ground. It's important, guys. I'll see you guys in a bit. All right, so I've wrapped up my bag, put away all my equipment. I'm going to show you guys the, uh, the car that they loaned me. It's a 2013 Toyota Camry. It's a fun little car. It's only got 500 miles on it. But uh, my car is so much stiffer. Uh, the power steering in this thing is something else. You, you just turn the wheel. I mean, you just barely touch the wheel and it goes spinning. Anyways, this is the car I'm driving. I'm on my way to go pick up my car that the service is finished on. And uh, I'll show that one to you guys. I hate traffic. All right, here we are, my BMW service station. Let's see if my car is in here. Let's go in here and get my car. That's not it. Where might my car be? I'll get back with you guys. I'm going to go inside, talk to these guys, and get my car somewhere out there. See ya. Oh, I got her back, and she's beautiful. All right, here she is, guys. My 2012. W335i. It's got the M package. That's the wheels you see there. It's got a stage two tuning kit. It's got an intake, all custom. 335. Nicest car I've ever had. We work hard for this bad boy. I'll show you guys the inside. Here. Here I've got the sunroof open, the windows down. I don't know if you can see inside, it's pretty dark. It's red leather interior. Let's see what we got. Here's my ride. Red leather interior. Bad boy's ready to go. Let's see what trouble we can get into. How good does life have to be to think that we don't deserve it? How do I deserve this? Living in this beautiful place, having this beautiful woman, having an amazing job. How does it work out? I really think if you're good to other people, good things will come back to you. They'll come back so plentifully that you couldn't dodge them if you tried. Be good to people. I'll see you guys when I get home. Alright guys, I'm pulling into my house. I got all the windows down. I wanted you guys to uh, hear the car. Here's my gate. Got a little button up here. Just hit it. The gate will open for us. Now I love this area right in here because it just echoes the sound so well. Here we go. Not bad, huh? Not bad at all. Oh, there's the service guys. I'll hide the camera. Anyways guys, I'm, uh, I'm back home just pulling into the top floor of my apartment building um, you know I just wanted to say to make sure that you guys like down on the bottom there like subscribe share it favorite it everything that you guys do with these videos I'm hoping to really get this channel up and running if you guys want to leave some comments down below let me know what you thought about the uh, the metal detecting or what you think about the car and uh, Obviously, I'm going to have some more silver videos up here soon, but I'll see you guys later. Bye.